Hello, it's Kwai Chi. Which juicer do I use? I use the Philips 1871, I think it is. Um, it's a centrifugal juicer. You get three types of juicers. Um, centrifugal, which is your quickest juicer, where you um, put in your fruit here. Uh, the thing spins round in here. The pulp goes into this bin here, and the juice comes out here. It even has a frost separator in the uh, jug so the froth stays in this top part of the jug here. It's extremely quick, um, this one's extremely quiet. That may sound loud to you but for a juicer it's very quiet, that's at the highest speed setting. It has a lower speed setting too for juicing softer fruits like strawberries. Um, juicers are not designed for starchy foods so you can't juice things like bananas in a juicer. Um, you can however in a masticating juicer. A masticating juicer, uh, imagine, um, imagine this bottle here and uh, imagine it going through a huge roller um, which crushes it. It basically crushes it, masticates um, the bottle into juice uh, and it comes out the other end and most of them have a pulp bin where it extracts a pulp some don't though so it's almost like having a blender um, in some cases uh, except you don't have to have any juice in it already to use a blender you have to have a certain amount of water or juice um, for it to blend anything up masticating juicer doesn't uh, the other type is twin geared, which is what you'll find in commercial places like restaurants and takeaways and juice bars. Um, they're masticating um, things again, but they have uh, two rods going like this, and they're literally squeezing things down through the middle of them. And uh, because of that, they're very fast and they got huge engines. Uh, they're very noisy, but they get your stuff juiced so quickly and um, they use very little heat, which means that um, you get full health benefits out of it. Centrifugal juicers, uh, you'll find that if you juice an apple, a lot of the time the juice will go brown. That's because oxygen has got in with the juice uh, and oxidised the apple. Um, so that's a very good example of where you lose nutrients. Uh, it, because it's spinning so fast, uh, it's um, it's mixing air uh, into your juice and it's mixing heat into your juice and those two things uh, equal less nutrients in your juice. However, for the speed, um, there's nothing beats a centrifugal uh, juicer at home and also for the economy. Uh, this juicer cost uh, about £80, which is about $160. US dollars. I'm sure it's cheaper in the US, though. So, um, and uh, it won Juicer of the Year this year uh, on an independent review magazine. The bin just comes out like this. It's huge. It's a two-litre bin. And uh, I would recommend that you bag it with two, uh, one or two shopping bags. You know, just a little shopping bag and then you just put it back in the juicer um, and, uh, and uh, when the pulp goes in there you literally can just lift the bag out and throw it away and I would throw it away very quickly the other thing about juicers is that you have to clean them straight afterwards this comes with uh, a toothbrush uh, it literally looks like a toothbrush um, to clean out the filter if you don't clean the filter straight after you've used it, the, the filter will become clogged up and you won't be able to use it anymore. Uh, so uh, that's the only downside about the juicer. It's quick to juice, but you have to clean it straight afterwards because fruit sticks like you wouldn't believe. Um, especially pulpy juice. It just clings on to anything. Uh, however smooth the surface, however non-stick, it will cling. But this is a fantastic juicer. I will recommend it and uh, for the price uh, I don't think anything else matches it and uh, uh, the juice that we get out of it is very good, the pulp is very dry and the juice is very good so I hope that helps, this is Kwai Chi signing out